Again, my good friend, good morning, wherever you are from on this big planet. This is Dr. Cherie from the Arizona, Arizona. And again, to those of you who do not know, I am the first cosmic cop teaching humanity to understand and respect God does make us you know. All right. Believe me, this newsletter, you know, all my newsletters are very, very interesting. But this one has something very special. And in no way will I take the time to read it all for you. So again, if you want to improve your cosmic awareness, if you want to read about the next SOS to the world, if you want to find out where magic is, it is in the newsletter. So there is no way around it. You will have, as soon as you're done listening to me, read the newsletter and this formidable content to me to know you to find out. In other words, Another thing, please, please, please subscribe. Subscribe to my news to my new channel here. Okay, I want you to take the time. Click on that little button. Okay? If you don't have time for me, if you don't have the money for me, you know I'm constantly giving, 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 giving. Show your support. Yeah, Doctor Chewy would like you come up and subscribe because that. With the algorithm, help me. And that's a way of helping others be part of the solution. Yes, Dr. Cherry, we like you. Subscribe right now. And for that, I say thank you. All right. Without further delay, let's get into that special newsletter. Title is clear. Cindy D. Calm, Stars and Fates. We're going to find out what this sucker is all about. And Hurricane Hailing. Undeniable predictions. Again, you will know if this is a true statement or not by reading the newsletter. But before anything, oh no, you think you read this? You did not read it. You have to read a few times to understand what Chanel and I we are offering you. Okay, so we are planning to do that hypnotherapy tutoring session on Sunday, November the 10th, and Monday. November 11. I picked 11 11 because that's the day of the completion, okay? Because it has always been a magic number. And I will fully explain why many of you have experienced this recurring subconscious phenomena. Many of you have seen that. Oh, 11 11, what's going on here? Well, you're going to get the real answers from me. Also, I want to personally thank the many students who sign already. For this course, okay, and we still have room for you, okay. So is your chance. Now there is much more involved in this course than what I can discuss just yet. But with time and patience, realizing and accordingly using your inner subconscious power, we come to the fore. Okay. Now tapping on this subconscious creative force is a sure ticket to better both your inner and physical life. Yet if you are not curious enough and ask for the divine, how can your life change? All right, remember and never forget, any and all disease, will it be physical or mental, are from a blockage. I will take the time to explain this fact in great details, and I will also take the time, that's why it becomes interesting, to remove it and offer the answer to anyone interested in knowing their own mental dilemma at a personal level. So you're going to get a little bit more than what you bargained for. Again, me to know you to find out when you join. It all starts by being inquisitive. And in a couple of days, our next supreme wisdom, instead of spending years suffering and wondering why you can't reach your goals, God's creative power is limitless and works on both the spiritual and physical plane. Yet again, it is only if you ask that you shall receive. Again, reading this article is not an accident. You know my philosophy, there are no accidents in this life. It's you being at the right time at the right place and offering you, again, the winning number of the lottery. Thus, let all the skepticism and lack of curiosity miss the boat. Okay, you got to read that. I ain't going to read all that. Take the time to read it. You can also email Terania and sign up for this class. Okay, and when you read it, please also sign my petition. Be part of the solution. 
Now, some of you have asked me to do the stars and fate of Saint Didi Kamb. So you can enjoy the power of the divine astrology or astral psychology by reading the following. Okay. Saint Didi Kamb was born on November the 4th, Scorpio, 1969. Okay. On the negative side, this sign rules sex, crook to cops, the FBI, the police, the mob, criminal, sex, control, abuse, and it's obvious. Comes is a true lizard, not a niggle. What is a lizard? We're coming in here, okay? And if you're a different sign than Scorpio, well, read your sign. But be sure you are a Scorpio somewhere in your chart. And unless you investigate it with me, you ain't gonna know. The ultimate power to die or rebirth is given to you. All right, it's lucky dragon's head, okay, is in the creative sign of Pisces. What does Pisces rules? The art, music, acting, dancing, but um, rich and famous, like all those celebrities, is not cosmic conscious, and like all crooks, he succumbed to the powerful pull of his dragon's tail. Now, his moon, which is his own life, and Pluto, which is a sexual obsession, is on his negative dragon still in the sign of Virgo, which is the warrior, okay? So those planets make Didi virginal, which means he has an extraordinary attraction to young, white, pure, innocent, vulnerable kids. That's why he wore white quite a lot of time. But the fact is, the reptilian infestation was in his home. Okay, again, I don't have the time to read all that for you. Take the time to read. That is the key. All right, now, let's get going to something very, very important. All right, before discussing the next SOS to the World Deadly Window, let me clarify a few things that may bring you more trust in my UFO predictive legacy. What happened to you, Dr. Thierry? Why are you so gifted? Well, click in here. Maybe you want to know. Okay, now this was written August 31st, and we are now at the end of this window. This window just finished, but the Quatrain, New Horizon Following Tragedy, Tears, pain, death, prayer, a new life for many really, really speaks of what just happened with the most horrible, the most powerful hurricane ever to hit Florida. Any words, again, are obvious because I don't have to fear. Many of you heard me. I may sound redundant. The phrase Inquisition, like Nostradamus, and I can keep my head on my shoulder. But the fact is there, read, read, and read. My windows always the picture specs at or above 6.0, and we go another one, okay? We had a 6.0 again in Argentina, uh, and another one on the 26th, that was yes, a couple of days ago, uh, in uh, Mauritius in the reunion. Shame on USGS. Take the time to read and see why Dr. Thierry is real. Again, remember, new horizon following tragedy. Tears, pain, death, prayer, a new life for many. Was I right or was not? Helen leaves at least 50 people dead, millions without power. Now, that's the key word, new horizon following tragedy, tears, pain, death, prayer, deadly weather, natural disaster, and a new life for many speaks of the reality of my predictions. Do you think, of, do you think honestly, thousands of people experience the beginning or ending of a portion of their life last few days? Do you think many of Florida will now move away, knowing Helene was the strongest hurricane and record to slam into Florida Big Bang region? I'm telling you, I'm pretty sure many will move away. And the fact is here, as Florida storm worsens, some in Tampa Bay wonder if it's leaving there is worth it. Not also, but it doesn't stop there. That's where you need to pay attention and stay, stay, read. As with Elaine, I also predicted Hurricane Italia. You can click here, Hurricane Katrina on coast to coast. 45 million people heard me saying in two weeks, be ready for a tremendous devastating hurricane that will change the life of millions of people. So I was right with Hurricane Katrina and also Hurricane Ian, yes. And I predict those hurricanes well before they are formation in the Atlantic Ocean. But again, it is only if you are a VIP that you will read the fact. 
Now, other thing that you need to digest, all the while NASA is wasting millions and the National Weather Service and NOAA can only follow and report the deadly hurricane as it unfolds. On August 31st, before I am formed in the Atlantic Ocean, using my SOS to the world daily window and the power of the moon as intended by God himself, I gave the date of September 28th and warned my international reading audience through my question and all the current anticipated dead news, exactly as I did with Helen. And that is what makes a difference between real prediction and fiction. Yet, as with my well-documented data in published an earthquake and prediction of 6.0, the scientific community, USGS and NASA, are like the FBI and the police, read, ignoring me and refuse to invest in my gift. Oh my God. Now, fear of the ridicule, lack of curiosity, educated pride, religion and cosmic ignorance are to blame. Lastly, do you think you should promote my work since it is real? Do so and gain good karma for being part of the solution. Now, you know what, my good friend, sometimes I really feel my gift is a waste of time, since a peace or a peace educated society is unable and unwilling to investigate and make good use of my cosmic work. At least you are there, you get to get it, and you are the lucky one, okay? That's why it's important to share my work. Again, like Jesus said, I feel like I give my pros of wisdom to swine. And here yeah, this big guy, everybody heard about Einstein. Indeed, we are living in time where bond had rise, intelligence has fall, educated in your reign supreme and tribe, while genius and real get unrecognized. That's the karma that I have to pay for being ahead of time and for being real. You get fired all over because people cannot handle the truth. Now, if the above is not clear or good enough to prepare you for the future hurricanes, that's the quatrain I wrote back in June, mean anything at all. Water, sky, ocean, oil, drench. Dark crowd, city, men cry, drown. Jesus, cosmic spirit, rebirth, religion, Pisces, deception, age, die. I mean, how more clear can I be? I wrote that in June. Well, before the worst of the worst of the worst, most powerful hurricane ever hit, you were warned. And you are the lucky one, as I said. Now, very small example scepters I took for my upcoming 2005 Notre Dame Mission Universal in person forecast. Okay, although you got Peter D. Okay, be the first one to get my prediction for next year. Be warned, be smart, and be prepared. Email Karanya right now. Order your copy. Okay. Now, to pay for it, it will be in your mailbox as soon as Tom, my phenomenal gifted uh, webmaster, is finishing producing it. Okay, this is prediction one. Okay, the very hot and windy weather climate pattern will help evil soul terrorists to light more fire all over the U.S. God not just over the U.S. Expect more natural disaster, fire, quick hurricane, volcanic eruption, death, and fire, explosion, etc. War and chemical, never experienced before. Was I right when I said that? The year 2025, like last year, expect another deadly hurricane season, devastating flooding, an earthquake of extreme magnitude, putting down bridge, road, and coastal city in jail party. Many people will be forced by Mother Nature to move due to more deadly and rigorous natural disaster. Was I right or what? As usual, those natural disasters will take place during my SOS to the world deadly window. One more reason for you to become a cosmic cutter and be prepared on, on reading all the windows for the entire year ahead of time. If you need to go somewhere, plan a holiday, travel, be prepared to respect God, cosmic design, or pay the ultimate price. Mother Earth, we're sure you must have thought, you got to read all this. you got to read all this because the second part of the quatrain is in reference to religion, to the age of Pisces. Okay, so let me give you some example, but let's keep going here. All right. Um, you read all that. Now, do you think the killing of Assam Nasharala marks a new beginning of the war in the Middle East? Again, yes. Everything you read today on the news was fully predicted in my last three 
ebook, including the new 2025. Not sure that means we're going to forecast when it comes out. Okay, now read and share my work, please. Now, this is what happened. Okay, he's dead. Okay, beginning, ending of important phases of life. Prediction number 16. The Aries Martian dragon will induce all sorts of traumatic news, killing innocent people, and will increase the possibility of mass death. Israel, Hamas war. The new Pisces dragon right on the Middle East is demanding pay attention for a full restructure of the oil industry and the entire region. The oceans and seas will suffer more pollution affecting sea life, water, and food supply. Do you, cons do you consider the current news an ending of life? Thai farmer forced to kill more than 100 crocodiles in the life. Do you consider this piece of new another beginning designed to end the nightmare experienced by those astronauts? That's a name. Again, another beginning ending of important phases of life. And God help, oh God help, those guys will make it safe on planet Earth. And those educated idiots out there want you to believe one day man will reach and leave on Mars. Oh my God, have mercy on your children's stupidity. Mars is not meant for any man to go there. All right, you interested about Jesus? Now that's where it comes, the second part of my question directly involving religion, okay? The Pope, the Pope is cruising all over Europe, okay? And he's designed to bring more deceived people into the church ink. It trap them in fear and ignorance. A little do they know again that Jesus was teaching astrology. You need to click on those links and read. All right, this being said, be ready for the next window. It will be October the 3rd, the 4th, the 5th, and the 6th. And I just line up, ugly face of death, drama, horror, your face. Okay. So if you know all about me, if you know all, if you've been reading me, now you know exactly that what we transpire will be a wake up call, will be death, police being killed, innocent people being killed being abusive, secret to light, sex, drama, wake up call, name it. And this is what I'm doing. This is what I'm doing for you, for free. That means I deserve a thumb up. I deserve to know where you're from in this big world. It makes me happy, okay? And most of all, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe right now before you exit this video, please, and read the newsletter, subscribe. Help Dr. Cherry. If you feel that I'm real, and I know many of you do, if not, you wouldn't come back. Please, please, please subscribe. Help me. Because I need to go out there. Because what I have is critical. What I have is real. You're smart enough to realize I'm real. So I need your help. Because it ain't going to be a big corporation. The reptilians have affected coast to coast to him who fire me, and all these ridicule, uneducated, idiot, God-fearing people. God is not about fear. God is about love and light. Jesus, the same story. He's not about love and light and higher education and cosmic consciousness. But the big corporation out there, like the big pharma, they do not want you to know. They don't want you to know because they need your money. It's all about this and that. <laughs> this and that. <laughs> all right, my good friend. That was a long speak. A long talk. I really appreciate you stayed all the way to the end. Now your part. Go and read. Take the time to assimilate. Remember, it's the beginning and ending of important phases of life. So if you want to grow and grasp that cosmic power, join my hypnotherapy session on 11. Until then, God bless all of you. See you next week.